So if you're only missing one tooth, why a dental implant over a traditional bridge? Uh, it's very simple. I mean, uh, with the traditional bridge, we're basically destroying two healthy adjacent teeth. And over time, we know with all the studies that's been published that the traditional bridge lasts about 7 to 12 years. And that's how long the insurance companies will cover it for this reason. But a single implant is such an easy and painless procedure for most patients where we come in and it sometimes can be done in a single appointment where we deliver even a temporary crown for a patient and they have a tooth back in place. So again single implant is just a much less expensive option long term for these patients so getting it done once yeah. and do you think it prevents future tooth loss absolutely because when we cut down adjacent teeth and we actually weaken them by putting a lot of force on them unfortunately what happens with time is a lot of patients will get fractures in them they'll need root canals they'll get cavities so it's kind of uh, opening a can of worms it opens up space for other implants to come the second one a third one a fourth one so single one is a much least, you know, less invasive way to treat if you had a family tooth. member and they were only missing one tooth and they were of the age they could do this, would you always do an implant over a bridge? Yes, Randy, it's an easy answer because I have done this for family members quite a few times.